When we opened in 2008, it was our focus to pay attention to the health and nutrition aspects and how it related to student achievement. During this last seven years, we've spent a lot of time working on teaching kids how to live a healthy and nutritious life and showing that that relationship is very clear. Four years ago when I started here, uh, the lunch program was full of chicken and just processed meat. What we were looking at was what are the healthiest options? What are the options that are available to us that are our healthy, nutritious, cost-effective, approved by the Office of School Foods? It initially came from the kids, though, the idea that what they were eating might not be the healthiest option. That led us to the menu that we have. Our menu has changed to fully vegetarian, and the kids are so much happier with it. We don't necessarily talk to them about it being vegetarian. They know that there's no meat in the food that they're eating. It's not that they shouldn't ever have meat. It's that while we're here, this is the healthiest meal that we can provide you. It's time to go, go to lunch right now. I am hungry. When it's over, I'm not hungry. There's got to be a lot of work done with the kids in nutrition, in health education, a lot of work done with the families to help them understand why you're trying to do that. We're bringing awareness. Really, that's the, the position that we feel like we're in. There's a lot of other options that are available now that weren't available three years ago. So what we hope is that schools become more educated about the options that are available. It's something that takes time. I'm, I'm are, are you going to eat your orange? Okay. After lunch, they're much more focused. They're not as sugar rushed or anything like that. Their performance definitely has increased since the change in the menu. Our student attendance rate has grown each year. We average over 97% daily attendance for the year. We've had some of the highest student achievement in New York State. And last year, we were number 11 overall in the state, according to test scores. I think that it's important for kids to be exposed to all the different types of food and also just um, moving forward in life that they would just think consciously about the foods that they choose and think about how that affects their performance in later life as well. We're very interested to show everybody you know, that this is possible and it can have a positive effect. That's what we want to do and we, we want to show what is possible.